Fire officials are not taking this lightly. Right here, you can see they've put an arsonist wanted poster right at the scene of one of these fires. And I want to show you just how close these are being set near homes right over there in the distance that is the roof of a home so as you can imagine residents here are on edge since monday crews have put out five fires at five separate locations all only miles apart in indian lake estates florida forest service officials don't think it's a coincidence uh, they're not lightning so they're suspicious and uh, a lot of these fires uh, the last five fires are in kind of remote areas so Gives us kind of a suspicious nature that they were set by someone. There was a fire on Monday on Alba, a mile down this direction. Those fires were yesterday. Both creeped dangerously close to Daniel Knickerbocker's home. Just down the street where another fire started, Gloria Lacey worries about her home burning up or worse, not being able to get out with her oxygen tank. You can get burned up in it or get trapped, you know, and that's the scary part. Wednesday afternoon, crews work to put out hot spots. We got crews that are coming over here. They'll mop that up because we don't want this thing to reburn and, and cause more issues. The flames eerily close to where more than 6,000 acres burned up just a few weeks ago. The residents are on edge here, and you know, so are fire service and the forestry folks. Uh, this puts all of our lives at risk coming out here and also the residents here. Now a new concern as residents watch and wait hoping whoever it is gets caught. But uh, it is it is uh, unnerving. I would send them straight, straight to prison, period. Any residents who see anything suspicious are asked to report it. There is a $5,000 reward being offered. In Polk County, Melissa Marino, News Channel 8.